and it looks like only one of them is actually infected. For every experiment performed, Dr. James Hildreth and his team of researchers are moving closer to answers about AIDS. In the U.S., African Americans account for more than half of new infections. But at Meharry Medical College in Nashville, there is hope. A vaccine for HIV may be a long time coming. So the best alternative to a vaccine is something called a microbicide. And these are gels or creams that women would use to block vaginal transmission of the virus. Dr. Hildreth believes the life-saving drug he's developing could become available within five years. One researcher wishes it could have come sooner. He lost his mother-in-law to AIDS 10 years ago. Having someone that's been in my life that's been impacted by the disease has given my work a lot more meaning. The HIV AIDS problem is a problem that affects people of color. Being at a, at a medical school like Meharry, which has traditionally served the needs of African Americans, there is a sense of pride that we may be a part of the solution. If you're going to go to work every day, you got to feel at least somewhat positive about coming in and trying to do something that's going to hopefully make the world a better place. No, B, C. The work that we're doing here is as cutting edge and top flight as work anywhere. When the story is told, we believe that it's going to be told that at Meharry Medical College, and at least a partial solution, was found for one of the most significant medical problems in the history of man, and that's not a bad thing.